Hello, Assalamu alaikum friends. Welcome back to my new tutorial of our TI portals. In this video, we are going to first discuss about the creation of our buttons and uh, indicator display in our Siemens HMI. So, you will see how I am doing that. So, you will see. I am just showing you another many things in our HMI. First, first of all, you will see that is our HMI, which is our uh, which is I added in my previous video, and the screen is now open. Now you will see I have a simple program, which is a set reset program to show how PLC works in our HMI. Now I am just making it to another output to show you some things. I am going to use two zero point one two. For it, I'm going to compile that. Now I'm going to work on on our HMI. So you will see. First of all, we need to zoom out from there. You will see. Now we are going to zoom out, and now we are going to select a basic element. So from you will add text from there. And give it a name. Like utility on button. And you will make it a color. What do you want to color? And increase your styles to. I'm going to select 23. Bold. To hammer. And. Uh, Appearance and what color we want to select. I'm going to select it from there. We select dark black. So that's how we add text in our in our screen. So I'm going to delete that. Now I'm going to show you how you create buttons. So I'm going to select an element. So you will see. I am going now to select the moment button and I am going to name it the start button. You will see now button has been created. Now I need a, I think I need a I am going to design a circle. You will see the circle has been designed. And I am just going to show how you program your start button so you will see going to animals and going to tag connection events I'm going to press and go to edit speeds and you will see set it while he is pressed Now you are going to add a tag, going to PLC tag, default tag, and your M0.0 is your start tag. You will see. Now I am going to make a copy of it, paste it, and change that name to stop. I am going to change that tag name. Going to PLC tag default tag. And I uh, will check that about bot tag has now. Momenti button has now. Okay. Now I am going to my circle. Select an animation. Go to appearance. Now I am going to select it to 0, 0 0.0 and 0 and we need the color and I am going to select red for it and for one we are going to select green.
I'm going to save that. You will see. I think my circles have been corrected. Now I need to compile that. I'm going to compile my and just to start simulation. Now I'm going online to make it small. Open my root screen. So you will see it will show me right. Think I need to make it small. So you will see, I am pressing start, so you will see it will return to green. I am pressing start, so you will see it will turn to, because I am using the same bit for my, that's why it's going not going to work. Now I am going to do the screen, I am going to start. I'm going to events press I'm going to change in that tag PLC tag and 0 0.1 now I'm going to compile that and again start my PLC So you will see this is start stop so you will see our momentary buttons and our circle display has now has going to work but now I am going to show you how our multi state button going to work so you will see I'm going to property select my multi state button going into general and selecting my tag and 0, 0.0 and you will see it will support about on and off and I'm going to stop that I need a copy of another that circle paste it there going to animation appearance I'm going to change that tag to, to 0 0.1 and I'm going to choose different to use it so I'm going to use a blue for zero and yellow for for our one so I think that both has now created zero errors only I think our HMI has now correct now I am going to start my HMI so if I am going to start that, so you will see it will turn to green and I am going to stop. So that's our 
this button is our say this button is our toggle button so you will see the working of our toggle button so that output will energize by a toggle so you will see i'm going to on this is also energized because you will see it will set to that field set to that bit also you are going to make it off you will see it will going off it will green because it is set that so that's how buttons momentary buttons toggle buttons and an ndd integrated displays in our simmons pie pro simmons plc simmons hmis so thank you very much for watch my video please subscribe my channel like my video and click the bell icons so so if you, you don't miss my next video so uh, in the comments you if you don't understand anything anything so make so do comments if you don't understand anything so thank you very much again for watch my video and thank you